Divine Collective, welcome or welcome back to my channel, Divine Goddess Enlightenment. I'm Ashley and I am here um, with a Karmic Mother read for you guys. I was picking up on some energy, so as you come in, don't forget to subscribe. Hit the bell so you can be notified of future uploads. Everything you need to know about me and the Unpolished Diamond, my poetry book, will be in the description below. Hi, Divine Collective. I hope you guys are doing great. I was just picking up on some energy, right? So, um, it's, Spirit is exposing. God has been exposing. The Divine has been exposing that your mother is really someone who's very mentally ill, your karmic mother. She's, uh, and I was picking up the energy too, that she, th the energy that this has been hidden. I feel like your mother has been hiding this very well uh, throughout the years, throughout your whole life. I feel like, um, I feel like she, this, your mother could have like, a personality disorder. This she could be uh, someone that's narcissistic. She could be someone that suff just suffers from unhealed un un wounds. She could be uh, someone. Uh, she could suffer with addictions. Okay, for some uh, others of you, this could just be someone who has a, just a sick, evil, dark soul. Like I'm really picking up on some toxic, dark energy with this karmic mother, and I feel like. Uh, this is something she hid so well from others, but I feel like as a child, you always picked up, you were always able to see through things. And by uh, most of you being chosen, you were born, you, are in, you were born with your third eye open. Everyone is born with their third eye open as a child, okay? But uh, you were born, your, your, senses were heightened. Your intuition were heightened, okay? When when you were a child, I feel like you guys went through, your mother put through, you through something very traumatic, a couple of, like more than one, multiple traumatic events that you guys could recall. I feel like a lot of you could be, a lot of you could be suffering from, uh, from bad dreams of nightmares or what happened or what have you. And, um, I feel like others of you, you you were suffering from uh from nightmares, but you're not anymore because a lot of you are being healed. Okay, it's balanced, it's being restored within you. Your angels, God, your ancestors are restoring balance within you. So a lot of you were having nightmares about the childhood trauma, but spirit is healing you. Some of you may still be uh, experiencing these nightmares. Okay. Uh, that don't mean just because you're still experienced, if you are experiencing these nightmares, that don't mean you're not being healed, okay? That don't mean you're not being healed. That could just that could just mean that you're having trouble letting go of something. You having trouble of letting go of something traumatic that happens to you. And that's totally normal. Okay, healing is an ongoing ongoing process. Alright? No one said it was fun healing. Like it's definitely a process. All right. So, yeah. Uh, we're going to get some overall energy. But, yes, this part, um, I feel the energy. God is, this karmic mother is been, it has been exposed or will be exposed. And like I said, uh, you, you, a lot of you, knew that your mother suffered for some some type of mental illness okay but she's someone someone that hid this very well i feel i pick up the energy of someone very deceitful someone very deceiving someone very two-faced uh, that's why i picked up personality disorder borderline uh personality disorder bipolar disorder okay What's the overall energy for this uh, Karmic Mother Read Spirit? Overall energy. We have refrain at the bottom. We have guidance and receiving. Yes, a lot of you have been receiving guidance from spirit. A lot of you have been... Uh, 
I feel like a lot of you have, uh, every since you were a child, every since you were a child, okay, you have been receiving, uh, you have been receiving guidance. You have been guided on your spiritual journey. You have been guided on your path, okay, because you are someone, I'm picking up chosen energy with this star. You could be a star seed, okay? I pick up star. Yeah, you are. I pick up. You're chosen. You're. You're. I pick up a star seed energy. That's why you see this butterfly as, as you were going through these many changes in your life. You have always been guided. You have. You have always been guided on this path. All right, and you have, especially with dealing with dealing with uh dealing with your mother. A lot of you are being guided to refrain, yeah, because a lot of you are having an awake awakening. Like I said, for like I said, for a lot of you, God is revealing this. God has been revealing to you the uh the, the this woman true colors. God has been awakening you to the truth. Okay. And a lot of you are being guided to refrain, to refrain um, from this energy, all right, from this unhealed woman. This uh, woman, I really pick up, this is someone very mentally ill, mentally sick. This is someone that doesn't, she doesn't believe that though. She doesn't see that about herself, I feel like. This is happening for me and not to me. So yes, yeah, Spirit wants you to know everything you went through, it, it was all a part of a, a divine plan, all right? And you have been receiving guidance. You are being guided to refrain from any toxicity, any negativity. You are someone very, very divine, very protected. A lot of you, uh, a lot of you could be having a uh, a lot, I feel like a lot of you get downloads. So, uh, you are very spiritually tapped in. A lot of you, you could be an Aquarius. I'm picking up with this star seed energy. But sure, someone that you're, you're very, uh, you're very spiritually tapped in, and you receive, you receive downloads. You receive guidance. Spirit is also wanting you to trust your intuition. Some of you guys may have been going against your intuition. I just picked that up. When it comes when it comes to uh, your mother, or this could be something you did in the past, like because of the love you have for this 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 mother. Okay, a lot of you uh, went against your own intuition because like you never wanted. A lot of you like who who wants. Who wants to uh, have to come to the realization that their mother is a karmic, that their mother is mentally ill, mentally sick, and this, this, uh, and like I said, this, this played a lot in your childhood. You suffer. Your mother puts you through a lot of suffering. I feel like your mother too. She's someone that projects. Your your mother is someone that's been projecting her energy, projecting her generational curses and her unwound hills onto you ever since you are you were a child. That's why the divine always walks with you. Okay, the divine always guided you, always shielded you. Because you are a gift. You 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 are you you are someone very special. Okay. Clarify receiving and guidance, spirit. Clarify receiving. Yeah. Knight of Wands in the reverse and the Ace of Swords. Yes, like I said, you, uh, you guys, you guys, this is being illuminated to you right now. A lot of you guys are coming to the realization. A lot of you guys are getting clarity of the fact that your mother has a mental illness, that, that you have been, a lot of you guys could feel like you have been, bu been, been bullied by your mother. Your mother is someone very narcissistic, someone that puts you through a lot of trauma. You're getting clarity. You're getting clarity on, on her true colors, who she really is. This Knight of Wands in reverse, okay? Someone very pessimistic. So, someone, I feel like too, this is, yeah, with the Knight of Wands in reverse, this is someone who tries to stop some type of truth. Yes. This is someone who tries to stop such type of truth from getting out about her. This this is uh, the energy 
of your mother not wanting to take a responsibility, accountability for this this sickness she has. She's been trying to stop uh, some type of this information of her being me mentally sick getting out. She been trying to stop the information of how you been treated as a child getting out. She's been trying to stop the information of her true self coming out. She's been trying to suppress this information. Your mother could be a Leo Sash or an Aries, a fire sign. Don't have to be. You could be a fire sign. Clarify, refrain, spirit. Clarify, refrain. Clarify, refrain. Ooh, we. The, the uh, Ten of Wands and a Five of Swords. Spirit, yes, Spirit, you are definitely being guided to, to pull your energy back, okay? You could be a Virgo to so go within, use your intuition, pull your energy back, okay? And refrain from this toxic mother, okay? This is, this is so, like I said, someone, she is very mentally conflicted. This is someone filled with drama. This is someone filled with chaos. This is someone very confrontational. This is someone that likes to argue. This is someone that, that projects. For some of you, your mother could be someone that, that uh, low-key compete with you, secretly compete with you. This is information she, do, she doesn't want exposed. But like I said, God pulled a lot of you back. God removed a lot of you from your karmic mother life so you could get clarity. You could get clarity on who this person really is. I just heard a soulless monster. I swear to God. Okay? You, God has pulled your, and you, you, oh my God. God has pushed your energy back for a reason. And if you are still around, if you are still feeding into your mother, if you are still giving her your energy, you are being guided to refrain from this. Okay? Because this is only going to cause burdens to you. Okay? Because your mother is vibrating on a very, very low frequency. Very, uh, she's, she's someone very toxic. She's someone, uh, could be someone very competitive. I'm picking up childish energy too. Like this is someone like what type of energy competes with their own children? The, this this mother yes, this mother bought you a lot of uh, a lot of burdens, a lot of struggles within your childhood, a lot of conflict. This carried over into your adulthood. A lot of you have to heal from from a lot. A lot of you are healing healing from a lot of traumatic, dark shit that happened to you in your childhood, all right? And like I said, this is information this karmic mother is not trying to get out. Yeah, a, a lot of you push your energy back. A lot of you could feel, a lot of you feel bad, though. A lot of you feel bad because you really, you really love this, this mother, okay? You really have, you really, you never looked at your mother as competition. You, you only wanted real genuine love. You only wanted a mother that was going to be there for you and support you, okay? But you didn't get that. A lot of you feel bad for having to pull your energy back, but don't feel bad. This is, you, your mother, that, your mother, I feel like that's not even, she is being occupied by low vibrating entities, okay? This is only for your own good. That's why you have always been protected since a child. You have always received divine guidance. God always kept his hand on you because you are chosen. You are the gift. And you are having an, an awakening. God is awakening this fact to you. A lot of you been getting downloads. A lot of you, you... I'm hearing follow your intuition. You God is enlightening you to this to this fact, to this situation. Clarify the um the five of swords, the five of wands spirit. Clarify the five of wands. Clarify the five of wands. Clarify the five the five. Thank you. Oh wait, yes. Yes. This mother, wow. For a lot of you, this mother has, has, it's like this mother has some type of vendetta against you. 
you being her own child. Like this mother, I feel like this is very competitive energy. This mother stayed competing, uh, competing against you. This mother could have did some type of chaos. So this mother, your mother could be someone very dark that does black magic, okay? Take it where it resonates. But for some of you, your mother did some type of chaos magic to try to cause you to become homeless. I feel like this mother, she 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 seen you the evil eye. This is someone, your mother is emotionally unstable. Your mother is, uh, she's mentally unstable, okay? This is someone... Uh, I feel like this is she this is someone that, that wishes ill on you. This is someone that could have did something to try to make you sick. Her energy is toxic. That's what I'm picking up. That's why you are a lot of you are being guided to refrain. Keep keep your energy back. Refrain from interacting with this energy. Okay. For some of you, your mother is experiencing bad karma. Your mother is experiencing bad karma right now, okay? Because of all the mental conflict, all the chaos she caused you throughout your childhood, she left you with a lot of scars, a lot of internal wounds that you are that you have to heal from. She burdened you, you she she burdened you throughout your childhood with all the projection that she did and she's experiencing bad health. Your mother could be sick. She could have some, like I said, for a, this, this is sickness too. A, a, these karmic mothers are mentally ill. Okay, some of these mothers, they could have internal illness. They have an internal illness, okay? Some of these mothers, they are headed straight into poverty. They are being spiritually and financially stripped. Okay, because of the because of the mental conflict and the chaos that they have caused for trying to burden you. They made the wrong decision. They made the wrong decision to come against their own child. And that's just period. They get in, they and y'all hear that knocking. I I feel like I that I picked something up. That knocking. I feel like this mother, she could be in a rage because you're not talking to her. That knocking like she trying to get in, but you won't let her in because you've been guided to reframe and pull your energy back. Very specific for someone. Clarify the, the Ten of Wands, Spirit. Clarify the Ten of Wands. 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 Yes. She, the Knight of Pentacles, this is the slowest night of the day. She, your mother was invested in causing burdens and slowing you down on this divine path. Your mother was invested in slowing your healing process down. She she was invested in causing burdens in your life, slowing you down on your divine path, slowing you down on your, your path to self-discovery of your life purpose of what you came here to do and what you came here to be. She was, yeah, I can't make this shit up. What you came here to do, what you came here to be. Someone very successful, someone chosen, someone that has been chosen for a higher calling. Okay, someone that that's, has been chosen to be a leader of some sort, to lead, I'm hearing to lead people that's in the darkness, to lead them to the light, okay? Because you, you are someone that you was born with this light. You was born with this light. That's why a lot of these karmic mothers, they, you, when you born with this light, the, the devil uses people close to you to attack you. That's why you have been, been spiritually attacked since you was a child by your own mother. And like I said, she is someone very mentally ill. She suffered from a mental illness. Wow. Yeah, since you were a child, you was destined for this. Since you were a child. <sighs> okay. Uh... What's the energy of this karmic mother spirit? What's the energy of this karmic? 
She's she's delusional. She's stuck in delusion. She's stuck in delusion. And like I said, for for a lot of you, if this if this if your mother sent you any type of spiritual attacks. Okay, if your mother sent you any type of spiritual attacks, they're all they're all been sent back ten times worse. Yeah, this mother energy right here, your mother could be a Virgo, Capricorn, or a Taurus. Excuse me. Yeah, but her energy, she's she's in, she's delusional. Like I said, she suffers from mental conflict. She suffers from a, a mental confusion, mental illness. She has a chemical, yeah, thank you, spirit. She has a chemical imbalance in her, her brain, okay? Mental conflict, confusion. This mother figure. Yes, ever since you were a child, she tries to keep you stuck. That's why she going through judgment. Karma is here. Clarify the seven of cups, spirit. Clarify the seven of cups. Oh, to a swords in a reverse. Yeah. The with this two of swords in a reverse, the illusion is over. Like I said, you I feel I've really picked up the energy. A lot of you guys, you 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 are someone very intuitive. Since you was a child, you always picked up on the energy of your mother. You always picked up on something being off mentally, uh, emotionally. Okay, and to your mother, a lot of you, your mother was uh, very emotionally detached from you. You never received affection. You never received true nurturing love. Okay. Uh, but yes, clarity, clarity for a lot of you guys, the, the illusion is over. Like I said, the mass is, the mass is coming off. God is really exposing the fact that this woman is really mentally, mentally ill and that this woman has been causing burdens in your life since she was a child. And she's, this is something she tries to keep hidden. She, she never wanted this. She never wanted people to see her for who she really is. She tries to keep up some, yeah, illusion. She tries to keep up some type of illusion. Clarify the five of pinnacles, spirit. Clarify the five of pinnacles. Clarify the five of pinnacles. Clarify the five of pinnacles. Yeah. Six of Wands, she thought she was gonna be successful at leaving you out in the cold. She thought she, she thought she was gonna be successful at making at, at leaving you out. Uh, for a lot of you, for a lot of you, your mother, she was very like I said, she was very emotionally detached. She was very uh, uh, defensive, defensive of you growing up. Um uh, your mother, she, um, she, I feel like she met, left you out in the cold physically, emotionally. Okay, she never shows you true, genuine affection. She never supported you, nurtured you, nurture you. For a lot of you, you felt that you just felt abandoned. You felt unworthy, and she was trying to be successful and making you feel like you were worthy, so you will wake up to who you are. So you will wake up to the fact that you was the gift the whole time. She wanted you to feel unworthy. Yeah, she, wow. I see the Ten of Pentacles. Yeah, she, she, she was defensive against you. She did not want you, a lot of, a lot of you, a lot of you are, are, uh, of royal, you got royal ancestors. You have, are, you of our royal descent. And a lot of you, uh, you, like I said, you have a huge, you, you're, you have your, a, a, a huge purpose, Okay. Your ancestors chose you for something. And yeah, for a lot of you, your mother, your mother tries to uh, leave you out in the cold about this. I pick it up too. This mother, she tries to leave some type of information away from you about some money with the Ten of Pentacles. Wow. Clarify the uh, Five of Pentacles spirit. Wow. 
Wow. Page of Cups. Like I said, very emotionally detached. Your mother is very, I uh, pick up, emotionally immature. She, uh, for some of you, she, she, this, this lady, she is, she's sorry. She going through uh, this karma, been left out spiritually, financially stripped. She could uh, want to apologize to you or she could have apologized to you. Or uh, she, she's just, and it's sorry, she's sorry for what she did. Cause she, I only feel cause she paying, she paying for what she did. Yeah, she's heartbroken. And with this 10 of cups too, she cursed, she cursed her own bloodline with this 10 of cups and it's uh, three of swords. That's why she's sorry that she's just in a sorry, miserable energy because she fucked up her own bloodline coming for a royal one. Wow. Final messages, spirit. What's the outcome? Final messages. Final messages. Final messages. Wow. We got the magician here. Wow. Okay. So, yeah. Final message is, ever since you were a child, page of pentacles, you going to, a lot of you, you going to be hearing, rather it's a download, rather you see this in a dream, or your intuition tell you, or someone can physically tell you, you going to be hearing some news about, uh, something that happened to you when you were a child about your mother um, mentally bit, like try, trying to keep you stuck, trying to keep you held back. Try, ch your mother trying to keep some type something away from you, trying to get you to not see something. You're going you gonna to get some type of enlightenment, some type of clarity, some type of news coming to you. Okay? And uh, yes, you are, you are, if you still communicating with this lady you are being divinely guided away to common waters a lot of you already have your angels god has moved you away from this woman because god only god knows what her karma what type of karma she finna go through and god do, he don't want you to see that he don't want you to see that or experience that so you are you are being divinely guided to karma waters, okay? Because God, God, like I said, God always had his hand on you, okay? You, you, if you continue to be around this person that you have, that you are healing from, God is going to delay your blessings, okay? You have, you have financial, you, a lot of you guys are manifesting a new beginning, okay? By you, a lot of you guys, by you selling away, by you giving a situation to God, okay? God is able to manifest new beginnings in your life, okay? But but you must refrain and you must move forward towards calmer waters. Yes, because judgment is here. Is here what I say. Judgment is here. Like only God knows. What's, what's this mother karma? Only God knows this mother karma, y'all. Okay? okay? What she really finna go through. A lot of them are losing money, okay? Could be out homeless, could be on the street. It got an internal Ill illness. Like I said, they try to hide the fact that they suffer, suffer from this illness. This um, What's that karma spirit? What's, what's the karmic mother... Wow. They karma, wow. For some of you, this karmic mother could uh could have came between some union. Came between you and a soulmate for some of you. Yeah, but her the, the this karmic mother, her karma is to watch watch God bless you. Her karma is to watch God bless you to be the woman that she tries to stop you to be. Her karma is to see you glow, glow up and level up and boss up on a level that she tries to stop you from, okay? Her karma is to see and know that since a child, you have always been, your steps has been guided by God because you are chosen, okay? You are, this is my channel. This is for the chosen ones. Take it where it resonates. 
Yes, and her her karma, like I said, this karmic energy is someone very, very mentally unstable. Okay, this is someone that her karma is to be bound and stuck to that sick ass mind, bound and stuck to the toxicity, to the negativity. Okay, this like I said, this could be your mother could suffer from addictions. Okay, this is someone like I said, that's not your mother. That's a low vibrating entity operating in her body her karma she's she's just she's gonna she's she's stuck she's she's stuck the same energy she, she tries to put you in this her karma she's stuck and she's she's been spirit, spiritually and financially stripped and the same energy she tried to manifest into your life it's all went back tenfold all right hope it resonated you guys don't forget to like comment Subscribe, share, all that good stuff. Until next time, peace.